I think I need more segments, you can just add the res here. I can take the cap segments up if I want to, to create some sort of a flat head. I don't like it very much. So this is Max and pretty much it's straightforward, it's really simple because if I'm going to take the line path actually and duplicate it, mess around with the series a bit and let's take this down let's switch this to the other side Okay, so all I need to do is take the, my cylinder, it's called stroke, stroke 0, 1 to be organized. I'm going to duplicate it as stroke number 2, pick path, my other path, it's going to be this, change its color actually. Let's change the stroke color as well. Move the path and it's pretty really simple in Max. There's always Max is really fun and fun and uh, half a toy for me because it's you can get the instant feedback in really no time. So this is Max. Let's see how we can duplicate. And obviously from here on we can move uh, to texture to, to create some sort of a light beam that's running in it. Just a just a stop, just scratched, uh, scratched the edge of the surface. Let's see how we can do this in Maya. Okay, so back in Maya, open a simpler file. What I have here is this setup. Let's take a look at the grid. Okay, so I have a camera already positioned. Let's lock it down. We won't move it by accident. I have three curves here, but uh, we're going to use first only one. Then you can see how we can uh, duplicate and use uh, already made curves. So let's use this curve. I'm going to press P because it's a bit segmented here. So this is much more nice. And I already gave it color white and yellow using. Object display, drawing override, enable override, and I choose the color. It's much more uh, visually uh, easier to see what's going on. So, first thing we need to do is create some sort of a cylinder. So we can run it on that path. Let's go to create polygon primitives, cylinder, and since I'm gonna uh, mess with it, so I don't want to worry about it. So first let's take the height and put in 5. The subdivision axis, the around, doesn't have to be 20, it's too much. Let's start with 8. Oops, I think I went into paint effects, but there it go away. So 8 on the subdivision axis, all the rest we can take care of it later. I want to put this cylinder Laying down, so rotate 90 degrees on x axis, and I'm going to freeze transform it. Now, to imitate the taper, I'm going to use flare, which is under animation uh, module, create deformers, nonlinear flare. And since the flare uses uh, some sort of a system of its own, it's going to create it uh, standing up. I'm going to lie down. But do not freeze transform it because it's going to be a bit of a mess when you, when you do that. So I, here I can play with the curves. Let's see why? Oh, because I don't have any segments on the on the cylinder, so I'm going to create some sort of a height cylinder, a height segments, and now. I can play with it, I can start the low bound earlier, 
everything is manageable so I'm not gonna worry about it right now I'm gonna deal with it later because here it doesn't give me any sort of uh, visual feedback of how the end result is gonna look so I'm just gonna put it in its default state I'm gonna keep that as an option let's change the uh, cylinder name to stroke mesh and now we have the flare on it we can smooth it using polygons module mesh smooth let's take the smooth and put it into let's say 3 or you can go up and down as much as needed for those of you asking why didn't you just press 3 because right now in uh, 2009 uh, we can press 3 and get the uh, a good result it's something that happens after everything is happening to that cylinder so if I'm gonna do something like try to flow that on a curve it's not gonna be uh, visually correct so I'm preferring to put my own smooth mesh in my own space and doesn't uh, need to worry about it. it's gonna render in, in uh, my software or how it's gonna look I know how it's gonna look and I can control it so once we have the capsule, let's just group both of them in, create a new group and call it capsule or stroke. Let's call it capsule 01. Okay, 